Sunday, August 30th, 2020. Oh, this isn't a good sign here. You know what this means. We got water coming in. It's a matter of time before this gets worse. So I'm going to get on the roof and I'll have to maybe do somewhat of a patch job here. Oh yeah, this is bad. So what I'll be doing is somehow climbing out of this window, I think uh, one leg at a time, then I'll make a right and walk up the roof. That's the probably the easiest way instead of getting a ladder and trying to do it. You guys remember that little B issue I had um, about a week or so ago, so I couldn't get on the roof until I took care of the bees. So I'll show you uh, what I bought for the uh, to seal that uh, that crack on the roof. So this is what I bought from Walmart. After seeing it advertised so much on TV, I just thought I'd give it a try. I'm sure it'll take care of whatever uh, crack is on the roof. I'm going to also take some... This stuff is good for uh, bees and uh, yellow jackets and stuff. Again, that uh, I couldn't go up on the roof until I took care of um, all the... the, the the wasps that are, were around the house. And in another video, I'm gonna show you how they can get into your house. I might take, I haven't even used this stuff. I might use this too, I don't know. But again, uh, we're gonna give this a try today. All right, folks, I'm up here. Uh, what I'm gonna do is climb up here, get on top there, and then I'll, uh, Fill it up. So I won't be taking any video until I get up there. But I'm up here. Oh boy, it looks like I can probably fix this part of the roof. Yeah. I'm just careful I can. Yeah. Anyway. Here we go. Okay guys, I'm back. You know guys, I'm not a roof guy, okay? And I'm okay to admit that. It doesn't look like the distance from this part here and the actual bathroom, that's where the leak is, is, is going through. It doesn't look like it's that far, but it actually is. And it's steep and I'm not, uh, it's, it's just kind of dangerous just to walk across there. It, it looks like uh, I, there's nothing up there to grip. You know, my shoes, uh, they don't have a great grip. So I, I think I, I might have to get call somebody in to uh, go up there and do that. So it's not a good idea to go up there. Anything could happen. I'm comfortable up there, but I'm not comfortable with crossing the uh, triangle there, so to speak. Um, as much as I want to do it, uh, I'm going to have to postpone this. Um, Oh, sorry about that. Uh, sometimes it's not good to be cheap. Sometimes it makes sense to uh, do it the right way. It's almost like uh, measuring twice and cutting once. So if I go up there without uh, the proper understanding, um, anything can happen. So I'm gonna cut this short. I got another project. I'll just uh, I'll just paint this small porch here. I know it's not uh, I know it's not much to do, but uh, it'd be nice to uh, make this look a lot, whole lot better. So when we come back, I'll just uh, I'll have this painted, and then I'll give you a tip on how to keep out. Uh, bees and wasps. All right, folks, this is gonna be it. Word of advice, when you're doing the little trim area, just get the one inch or the one and a half inch brush to get under the studs.
like so. And you, you should probably start with something like this and then get your paint shield to, you know, cover the uh, existing paint. I didn't do this, this was already, well maybe I did, but it's not that bad, it's okay. But it makes a, a little paint makes the world a difference. Here's my, my my kit here. Good paint here. Uh, what do we have here? Let's see what this was. Uh, yep, Benjamin Moore. Very good. It's interior, but this is what we had. So had to scrape the bottom step here. A lot of bad pieces. But it turned out really good. Some really good paint. Really like it. So that's going to be it. And again, I'll um, might have to bring in an expert uh, to tackle this leak I have. But what I'll do when that uh, when that's sealed, I'll do a video on um, adding joint compound to cracks on the interior walls so that's gonna be it thanks a lot take care of your families take care of your bodies take care of your lawns too bye okay you see where the windows frame and the brick meet believe it or not these can get in here so what you want to do is you want to caulk this all the way around. You see the little guy? You might see him flying around. Maybe, maybe not. But they, I sprayed some stuff in between the window seal. So I even heard them within the window and they die and they can get in. But the thing is, if there's a crack within the window seal on the inside of the house, they'll find that little opening and get in. So again, what you want to do is just seal this up. I'll do it sometime later, but trust me, they can get in through this crack right here. All right, take care, bye.